Hello everybody, it's Mr. Alston, how are you doing? Um, I know this is going to be pretty difficult for everybody during this time, you know, Wi-Fi and all that good stuff, but, you know, I'm going to tr we're going to try to work together as best as possible. So, you know, for the work that we'll be doing is I wanted to show you guys this website. It's called DocHub.com, so I will show you right here on my screen. Click right here. It's called DocHub, so it's D-O-C. Do lowercase d o c h u b dot c o m dot com. Now you guys all have access to this because of the <clears throat> because of your student website. It's actually like a subsidiary to Google, and you guys all have Gmail accounts. So let's go right here. So well, yeah, we'll just remove this thing. Ignore, dismiss, whatever. I don't know what that means. So. Now, this website, basically, when I give you guys worksheets, or for any of you teachers, for that fact, if you guys get a worksheet, you guys can go to this website, you guys can take that worksheet and download it onto your computer. I personally download almost everything onto my desktop. It's a bad habit, but I do it anyway. So, I'm going to come over here, I'm going to click New, okay? So since I put it to my desktop, it'll be under my computer, okay? But you can also get it from Google Drive, OneDrive, whatever. But I don't know how to do those things. So I always go straight to the computer. So I'm going to click computer. Now we're going to do this. Where's there? We'll do the coronavirus worksheet, okay? So I'm going to select this. I'm going to click open. Okay, so now it's downloading what I was doing and this and that. Here it is. Okay. So this is basically what a basic, this is a very basic worksheet. I don't think we'll be doing this one. But anyway, coronavirus is basically like a little short um, worksheet to give them information, background information, all those sorts of things. And at the end, it will be questions. So how are you guys going to answer questions? You can't really write on your computer screen. You can, but you can't send it to me. So let's look at it right here. So let's go to this first question. Which country did the virus come from? Now, there is a way that you guys can put that on the paper. So your answer on the paper. So I'm going to come up here to this top bar and it says add text. I'm going to click that. Okay. I'm going to line it up right here. See how the letter A is right there. It's right where I want to write. So I'm going to press and I'm going to hold it. And I'm going to drag it over here. So the, I know the answer is China, but I'm going to come up here like I did the reading. The coronavirus started in... The Chinese city of Wuhan. All right, so it's China is where it started. Okay, so I'm going to write the word China right in here. All right, so I'm gonna come right back up to click on the pointer. Now it looks pretty good right there. Actually, it does fit pretty nicely. But let's say it doesn't. So I'm going to I'm going to highlight it. I'm going to change the font. There we go. Change it nice and small. But I like it back where it was. Let's pull it back to 12. There we go. And you can also move this wherever you want too. So you can click right here, move it wherever I want to put it. There we go. And you can just delete it if you don't like it there. Now down here, let's say right here, fill in the blank, whatever, go right back up to my text box. Click right here. Just type that. It's like, all right, I think this one is F. And I think this one is J. I don't know if there is a J. There is a J. Nice. So let's say again that J is too big. I'm gonna highlight it. Let's bring it down to eight. There we go. That fits nicely. Little J right there. All right. And down here it shows a word search. So what I'm gonna do right here is I'm gonna come up to the top, find the circle, add circle. Now you can also do different shapes too. You can also do add a square, just a line, pointer, whatever. I'm just do the circle. So I'm gonna find, look for some words, and look at that virus. It's almost like I practiced this beforehand. There we go, virus. So that's basically all you need to really know about how to use this. You can just copy, add your text box, put it wherever you want, put it right here. Um, make the font whatever size you want, put it to 12. Type in what I want. Let's do Mr. Alston is awesome.
let's put some emphasis on that fantastic all right guys so good luck with all of this please feel free to email me if you guys have any other questions okay and see you soon